everyone. Today I'm gonna show you something that I just learned, um, which is how to push code from VS Code directly to GitHub. On my journey, um, I have been using GitHub Desktop, which makes it super easy to push your code that you're creating to GitHub from your local files over to the cloud storage of GitHub. So VS Code is a text editor that I use. You can actually just push your code straight from there. So what I'm gonna do today is show you how to do that. All right, so to start, the first thing that we're gonna wanna do is open up Visual Studio Code. Here we have it. And we're gonna want to drag our file that we want to work with and put over on GitHub into VS Code. So I'm gonna to go to my personal coding projects and I'm gonna pick one of these files. We'll just do a portfolio site, drag that over. And as you can see, all of my files are here. Awesome. So once we have all of our files here, we're gonna to want to go over to our GitHub page. So here's my GitHub. I'm gonna add a repository and we'll call this one, let's see, what did I call it? What was this file called? It was called Portfolio Site. So literally we're just gonna call it Portfolio Site and we're gonna call this VS Code to GitHub Tutorial and we're gonna make this private because it's not something that I wanna show just a random file <laughs> and we're going to put create repository. All right. So once we have this repository created, we're going to copy the link to the repository and we're going to go back over to our VS code editor. Here goes my portfolio. What I need to do now is I need to go into version control. So the cool thing about VS code is they have this source control right here button. So we're going to click on this and we're going to initialize the repository. So I'm going to click on initialize repository and now we have it initialized. Awesome. So the second thing we're going to need to do is we're going to have to do our first commit. So let's put in our first commit message, which is going to be initial commit. And you can either press this button right here or you can press command enter. And it's gonna say there are no stage changes to commit. We sure do want these ones to commit. So now that we have that, that's great. We're gonna go ahead and click on the three buttons on the side right here. And we're gonna put push because now we wanna push our code over to GitHub. So once I click that, it's gonna be like, no, you don't have any repository, no remote configured. Great, we're gonna add that remote. So this is where we're gonna go ahead and put in that repository link right here, right? And I'm just gonna press enter and it's gonna ask me for a remote name and I'm just gonna call my remote name Africa. VS, Africa VS Code. So the next thing we're gonna to wanna to do is we're gonna to go to these three buttons again. We're gonna click on it and we're gonna push our code. So we're gonna go over to push two, and then here goes our link again. We're just gonna click on the link and now it's gonna go ahead and push it. Okay, so if you haven't logged into your account, um, typically this is where it would ask you to log into your account but let's just check to see if our code is actually on there. So I'm gonna minimize and we're gonna go back over here and I'm just gonna press enter. And voila, <gasps> we have our actual code. So here's the code. This was just a template code that I added. It's there now and all I had to do was click a few buttons. So this is why I really love using um, VS Code to push. And I'm so happy that I was taught how to use it because I'm gonna keep doing this. I hope that that was helpful because it was helpful to me and 
I will be a lot more productive as I'm writing my code and I'll be able to uh, have some version control, which is really nice. I appreciate you hanging out with me. Bye. <laughs>